welcome to this video. Those that know me, those that don't, um, regardless, <laughs> you may have heard of um, the the Wuja belt or the Wuja vest. I recently purchased um, the Wuja belt just simply because I wanted to be a little bit more portable. As you may be aware, some of you that um, recently got a, a new light machine called the RX1, which is uh, by Roxiva. Uh, latest edition uh, of Brainwave Audio Visual Entrainment, which is an amazing light machine. It's uh, very easy portable, it has Wi Fi, Bluetooth, it has. The reason why I'm doing this video is that it has a headphone port connection, a 3.5mm jack input into the back of the RX1 light machine. So this light machine has just come out this year in 2021 and um, so far I've been you know, really amazed with it. It's an amazing piece of technology. But I was certain things what to go with it, you know, like to enhance the experience, to get more of a, a thrill with um, with with the beauty of sound and vibration and light and as a lot of you know that I'm I'm like a gong player so I'm a sound healer I've been very much into sound for for many many years and how I found Wuja was I was searching for uh, vibration cushions now I've got one that I've had for about 25 years my father gave it to me as a present uh, many many years ago and I had like a PlayStation 2 and I used it to like vibrate like the back of my futon and it was amazing amazing experience I really enjoyed like the gaming uh, with it but over the years um, using like audio strobe and uh, mind machines I've always incorporated the uh, vibration cushion that I had with um, the, the lights you know as many of the other lamps that came out before the RX1 so recently I've purchased the Wuja Bell and this is it here. It's quite a small thing when it came in, it came in such a small box or so just a, a brown box, like parcel box outside of this and it was like quite small and I was like, oh, okay, it's, I wasn't know what to expect. But um, I've used it quite a few times already. Uh, I've used it on some very psychedelic trance music with the RX-1, works amazing. And there are other tracks such as like, um, there's like uh, Chakra Chants, I believe. Uh, I use it with some music. There's a deep bass there, which goes amazing. Now, the idea really is to use this around like your waist or put it on your chest, put it in areas. But I actually found, which is an amazing place to put it, is when you're laying on, on a mattress, um, having it underneath you and touching the mattress basically and it vibrates the whole bed now this little thing you might think no, that little thing but you know i guess technology has gone such a far away now i saw a 3d render of this how it was you know their design about what they wanted to put together so it was um i bet i, I guess it was like kicks not kickstarter it was something else that they were doing to promote uh, the belt and they had a lot of people um you know in the many months I guess because of lockdown that wanted to purchase it and it's it's great for I guess gaming uh, music um, but I'm going to tell you about the features it's such a small thing like it's it's this size you know it's like the I guess the width of like a, a mug a cup a standard cup or mug and um, really if you take out this belt part it's just this this middle part these are just the straps to put it around your body um, very easy to put on um, take off but I like things to be in place and I can move about so I've experimented putting this underneath my pillow my bed because um, at the moment I have the RX1 the light machine above uh, my bed on a an installed like monopod with a, a, a tripod arm so um, yeah, the, the great thing about this is that it's got an internal battery and I haven't tested how long this battery lasts yet but so far it's lasted quite a few hours and the, the charging of it takes some time. But another great thing about this is that it's not just um, it's not just a vibrating cushion, like, I'm sorry, it's not just a, a, a vibrating like bell, it's also like an amplifier I found that has an input, like um, a 3.5 millimeter jack input that goes in in one so then you for me anyway for for those that are probably watching plugs into your mp3 player or um plugs into the rx1 and then you plug your headphones in this other slot here 
and then the middle one is to charge. It uses a Type C um, USB connection, which is really cool because I'm using them with my phone currently. Um, and I prefer the Type C. Do you know why? Because you can't go wrong. You put it in either way, and it's gonna it's gonna go in. Unlike the um, micro um, micro USB um, connections you found on like other Android phones. You end up putting, oh, is it, which way is it? So I feel really comfortable that they've done a Type C connection. So my thoughts so far, I mean, yeah, I wanted to purchase the vest, but I didn't want something so big and bulky. And also I wanted to be quite transport, like I wanted to be like travel with this and go out to nature or try it with some music. And yeah, this, this so far has been an amazing purchase. And don't be put off by its size. Like you might think, oh, it's small, but like it packs a punch. Um, I can't really give you a demonstration at the moment. I'll probably attach it to another video, but to see some ripples or vibration. But like this really packs a punch. I mean, like of bass, and you don't hear music from this. So it's got transducers inside. That's what I believe. It hasn't got like a speaker. So don't be prepared to plug this in and put it to your ear and, and listen to the song because you're not going to hear it. You may not even hear a vibration, but it does it. Um, you won't hear any bass, but you will feel a vibration going with the music. And it's very, very strong. Um, has Bluetooth on there as well. I haven't got around to getting it connected to Bluetooth yet because I've been so busy on many other projects um, working as well. So. Um, but I've had this going on a few psychedelic uh, audio visual programs under the light machine and it is a, it's an amazing experience <laughs> because with the light machine like you know for, for many years like the light, light machines and my machines have just come out with just just the light only and people relax under it but then recently um, the RX1 um, which has been you know the latest edition of, of lamps that is it's, it's future proofed it's got a, a roadmap for the future and it's audio visual synced so when I heard about this first of all I was like really excited about the audio visual concept um, which is actually in the RX1 now I don't have it on me to show but you can check out my previous videos about the RX1 by Roxiva um, yeah audio visual so basically you just plug your headphones the back of the uh, of the head of the RX1 where it has got the buttons and settings and session control and um, yeah so recently I, I plugged the the Wuja belt in there and I experimented because they said that you can strap it around your around your chest which is an amazing experience uh, or around your waist um, or the back of your spine and laying down on the bed I actually put the back of my spine um, with my back like laying on top of the bed and it it vibrated the whole of the bed I mean I had quite an intense like psychedelic trance track um, Return of the Squirrel so I tried that with it and it was an amazing experience um, so it just adds to that other element of, of music and they're right I mean the creators of Wuja I'm not sure where they're based exactly um, I haven't looked into into that night states okay um, so basically you know they, they they've advertised this for some time and it's been on my mind and um, yeah they said it's like you, you've been experiencing music completely wrong and I mean it's like have you ever been into a car when they've got like a huge bass on the back and it's like when the whole car is like shaking it's a little bit like that but this isn't like a more of a portable like smaller version but it's still quite intense so um, yeah I've had a really good good time of it so far um, it's very easy to use it's got an on button at the top so you just hold that down to press it on um, red light comes on I guess and to say that it's not fully charged I haven't charged it to its full capacity yet um, and there's a blue light showing uh, Bluetooth um, which I'm gonna get around to and getting that connected soon but because of using the RX1 I haven't got around to using the, the Bluetooth on it yet and also it has a positive uh, button here and a negative button I guess well this is for the, the the volume so as I said this is like an amplifier as well like you know plug your headphones in this so you plug this into like your music player your mp3 player and then your headphones go in this but I actually have found that it makes the music sound a bit louder as well better quality so you can control the volume of the music by pressing up and down of of these buttons 
uh, left here, which is the positive, um, more volume, higher up, and the other one, which is much lower. And then the other two buttons on this circular, I'm not sure if you can see this properly, um, is the up and down of the intensity of the transducers inside of the, the Ruja Bell. So you, if it's too intense for you, you're experiencing some sort of vibrating <laughs> experience, then you can turn that down. Um, yeah, so for me, it's 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 quite light. It's, um, how can I say this? It, I don't know. Um, I don't know how. Maybe it's the, the weight of a phone, just about that, I guess. A standard um, smartphone. Just turning it off, save the battery. Should last long anyway. I mean, it's lasted quite a while anyway at the moment. <clears throat> um, yeah, so I'm really, really, you know, over the moon <laughs> about this. This is a really good purchase um, because with the RX-1 I plan to travel and, and take the light machine with me to places and give people the experience. So, I mean, I could even put this into a, a cushion, for example, and put it at the back of a chair and give someone else the experience so they don't have to have it on them. Um, so yeah, I'm just finding ways how to, to use this belt even more and even therapeutically because the, the potential is unlimited with uh, sound healing because you can potentially put a, a vibrating bass tone and you can put it on a part of your body and you can heal a part of your body which would be a really good idea I'm going to be looking into but more so just having more of a deeper and personal experience with Roxiva or those that quote, call her Roxy in the community at the moment um, our little Roxy so um, yeah so far this this Wuja belt has been really cool inside the box you get this little carry case it's this little bag but just keeps it from keeping like scratched and protected or just carry it around let's say you get in the box a a type c usb um connection which is one of these i'm not sure you can see that um you know probably know what that is already and then you have a um male to male um 3.5 millimeter jack and um, yeah, I guess this is quite long. I haven't undone this yet because I haven't needed to. But you know, good quality looks like. You know, it's quite a good distance. There we go. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be using this a lot more uh, with my reviews on the RX1, um, at the new new light machine of 2021, as I as I call it. And I say so far I've had a great experience. So um, I'm gonna put a few clips uh, in this video where you can see that. Um, I don't know, vibration of water or, or me with it on, you'll see it in a, probably a few other videos. But so far, I'm really enjoying this. So don't be put off by the size, you know, etc. If you're a serious gamer um, and you don't mind wearing something, I really recommend the vest. It's probably much more of a bigger experience. Um, but yeah, they've done a really good job of making, you know, this a thing which uh, I'm really happy about. I've seen it advertised constantly after my research of transducers and bass speakers and, you know, what, what a great product to have that, you know, does, it's plug and play, you know, like at the moment I've got a lot of solar panels with free energy, so charging this up doesn't cost me. And yeah, it comes in this nice box um, with a little manual as well, with different languages, user manual and tells it everything you need to know. I've pretty much covered every, everything, basically. Um, harp, harpic distortion. So basically, if your Wuja edge starts to make an, a rattling sound with powerful bass frequencies, please turn down the harpic intensity source level until the rattling stops. And that's what I said a minute ago. Just with these buttons here, the up and down, you can just turn down the intensity. So it's like, it looks really cool. It's like a power belt, you know, if you wear it and also you're, you know, you're showing it off. And people ask you, oh, what is this, you know? <laughs> but yeah, so far I'm, I'm really happy with, uh, you know, the purchase. And um, yeah, I look forward to if they have any more products coming out their way. But um, so far now, yeah, you know, get yourself one of these if you enjoy sound, music, gaming, uh, especially light machines, because this is a great addition. And this is why I'm recording this video as well, is because if you want uh, a product to go really well with the RX-1 or a light machine, um, then I really recommend the Wuja belt because you can travel about with it really good. Um, so that's all I've got to say for this video. Um, I'm going to have another go in it now, but um, nice to speak to you and uh, catch you next time in another video. Take care, have a great day.